everyone here. Um, today is Tuesday the 3rd of uh, October 2017. I just make a point of um, um, putting dates on these um, uh, videos. They are cited fact evidence for any court hearing or in particular our court hearings on the native uh, magistrate courts uh, that we conduct uh, on a um, equal level to the King's Bench Court in um, uh, Britain, UK. Uh, being in partnership with this flag uh, gives us that, uh, that uh, authority to speak on a king's behalf in his absence until another king is um, uh, put on the throne. That's King Ernest Augustus V, uh, or if he abdicates to his son, Prince Regent Ernest Augustus, um, 33 years old, and uh, uh, the King is uh, already incumbent of a British uh, UK Hanover title um, that uh, no one can, no other King can override his uh, legacy of um, paramountcy and um, um, descendant, direct descendant bloodline to the Dutchman King William III and King William IV. Um, <clears throat> hang on, I've just got... I know. Uh, that's my friend, Minus Floris in Philippines. So, all I'm saying is, um, uh, to people watching these videos, uh, we are uh, making the bold statements of fact that has been missing, been covered over by the Crown Corporation and um, is not uh, in our interest um, to be in that state of mind anymore under that control. And now I'm going to ring uh, my lawyer, if I can find his phone number. Um, oh gosh, I've gone and lost it now. I usually have all these things ready. And I've just uploaded um, um, a letter to him in the email. So I always make sure that people know what I'm doing. Oh gosh, this internet is not good. It's really terrible. It plays up all the time, this people here and their connections, their, their um, um, router plays up on me, if not the best. Um, just waiting for it to open up. It's just useless. Very useless. I'll see if this works. Oh, it does work now. Okay. i got two channels going at the same time. Not good. Cross that out. I hate computers that don't work. Like this one. I wish I had the phone number ready. Um, let's see if this works. Oh, there she is again. Right, the video worked. Hi, John here. Um, it's Thursday today. Oh, it doesn't so turn off. Of Just have to cross the whole lot out. Um, not happy about so now. Okay, that's that. Um, so now I go to, I'll go this other way. I'm using Google. I've got to use Google. Um, it's useless. You see my frustration with having slow.
computers. The um, Firefox doesn't work. It's been jammed up by Microsoft. Oh no, that's your cup. No, there's something going wrong with the getting through. Wow. That's really strange. Shut that all down. Right, that's all gone. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll restart my computer. I'll restart my computer. All I do is just kill it. Yeah, kill it, pull it quiet, and off she goes again. And I'll put it back in place again, but in the meantime, I'll talk to you and uh, just tell you what's going on. Um, usually, I don't want to muck around on videos, waiting for things to start up again and all that sort of thing, because my computer's absolutely jam full. Um, and I've got two more computers sitting here, I haven't even used them, they're yeah, new ones. So I have to, at some stage, change over. Um, um, now that I've downloaded everything, uh, just to keep things running. And I'm running out of room in here as well. Um, so I'll be going into a bigger place with more room to work in. Um, so, uh, in the meantime, I'll just, just make another phone call. rather sad today because you'll hear in a minute. Hello? Hello? Yeah, Ash has just popped into the shop. Oh, oh, I just wanted to say hooray to her, that's all. Okay. Alright. Alright. Yeah, all right. That's Ari, her mum. Ashley's mum. She's off to uh, Spain today. And uh, I miss her already. Uh, but she'll be working with me in Europe and um, uh, Britain. Uh, so it's good to have my family there. And Catherine's already in London um, in the media section. So she's um, onto it. She's um, well and truly settled in there by now. Um, so uh, I got my family there. That's a good thing. So now I'll just open up my site again. I think that's what happens. The routers here, they, they collect anything trying to jam me out, which is a good thing, the Chinese uh, owners of this building. Um, so uh, I'm thankful of, of that. But at some stage, I'll, I'll, I've told them already that I'll be leaving here. But it's been good. It's served the purpose because it's got a lot of parking outside for all my visitors that come from north and all over the place. But in town, we had no parks because the biggest problem was the city was cost too much for parks <coughs> on the waterfront prime place. Um, so um, now I'll be able to um, um, get, a, get ahead with everything I need to have at hand uh, in our business. Um, with the Paramount Chiefs, they're happy. Um, and Kingi Toto is happy as well, because I haven't been in touch with him for a long time. Uh, so now um, all is restored. Our, our differences put aside, and we can move on. Uh, so I don't hang anything in my head of anything that was untoward. But I just didn't want him mixed up with Peter Poloni and the um, Waitangi National Trust and their corporate um, piracy going on in there, trying to steal our flag and our eight point star. We were in trouble. We were in trouble now with the Paramount Chiefs and this new um, native grand jury magistrate court in Ipsum. I have access to there any time for any great meetings or court hearings that concerns their marae. That's the closest to One Tree Hill. So they have first preference <coughs> of jurisdiction to what we do on that marae, straight to Hokianga and Kaitaia. Those uh, chiefs up there are in, more in the running than what is happening at the Bay of Islands with the uh, Maori 
Huey trusts are making things difficult all these years. It's not going to be the same anymore. So we'll just clean up the act and get on with it. Oh, he's asking. Hello, hello, Ash. Hello? Hi. Hi, I just want to say hooray. And huh? I just want to say hooray when you go over, when you fly out. Yeah, yeah and, and and be careful because even over there in those countries, it's really just watch where you go and don't go by yourself around the place. Yeah. I, I just make sure make sure you you don't go walking around by yourself. Always always make sure because I'm watching it online all the time, especially in Spain. They've got trouble with their elections at the moment. And there's a lot, yeah. of, a lot of things. So just avoid those things and in any of those countries over there. So anyway, you have a good trip, eh? Thanks, Dad. I'm missing you already. <laughs> Yeah, I will. I will. But I'll let you know what's going on here. I'm just about to ring, bring my lawyer. I just wrote him a letter, a long, long, long letter. So we'll see where that You're goes. What? I, read, I wrote him an official letter to take up <coughs> the contract that he wanted for for the tide turbines in uh, hey. South, South Korea. Choi, you type Choi, my South Korean lawyer. He's a GC. He's the one that no. si signed the documents and went to England. So I'm just, I'm just going to, I meant to go and see him today, but I'm just right to him first. And then, and then um, I'll just wait for him, I'm just going to call him shortly and, uh, and get an appointment to go and see him to wrap it all up. Yeah, yeah, so, so that, that, that is all, all ready to go now, but I'm just being super careful to make sure all my, my documents uh, stack up. I got I got the chiefs behind me now, so they'll pay the bill for the lawyer that I'm I've paid his bill since 2012 for the, for the work he's done for me. So now they 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 said they'll take care of it, and so that'll make him happy that he can finish finish off finish off what he was doing. Okay. You all you all excited to go? Yeah, I'm not. I'm still packing. Oh, I see. And and. Yeah. And, and your sister and brother didn't ring? Oh, I didn't tell them. Oh, oh, okay. Like, no, that's all right. I haven't called them. Yeah, no, never mind. Never mind. I'll tell them when you're gone. I'll tell them when you, I'll tell them when I'm there. Yeah, I'll tell them when you're there. <laughs> yeah. I haven't told them. <laughs> so, so I thought, oh, well, you, want, you, you don't want any, any, any um, a scene when, before you go. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, so, uh, no, that's all right, so long as you leave on a happy note there and, and um, have a safe trip. That's all I wanted to say. Yeah. You have a safe trip, but look after yourself, because I, like I'm saying, I'm, I'm just watching it online all the time, and because I'm going there too, so I have to, I have to be careful to, to protect myself. Uh, with those chiefs are saying, no, they'll, they'll, they'll do all that for me. And when we go, we, we're going together, you see. And so we're just uh, getting everything ready now. It could be this month that we're gone. Um, but I'll, I'll just see the lawyers. The lawyers going to have to do everything over there and here. Yeah. But he's done everything over there already. He just have to pay him before he does anything. That's why, that's why he did nothing. Because I didn't pay him anything. <coughs> I don't know what that'd be, might be 20,000 or something like that, but that's nothing when you've got a tribe behind you. I've got the whole tribe behind me, they'll just pick up the bill and pay. And that's, that's the end of that, so I should see some, some success in it. That's all I can say anyway. But on the other note, you just um, um, have a good trip and make the most of it. Yeah. Yeah, well, and we'll catch you up online, eh? Uh, yeah. Okay, love you. Okay, love you. And Take care. Okay, bye. Bye. Now that's my daughter. She's 26, I think. Catherine's 27. Uh, so, oh dear, didn't tell her sister and her brother. Oh dear. Uh, but no mind. They'll, they'll understand. They're grown up tonight. But we used to have a little party before we go, when she goes. <coughs> but because of all the things that happened, uh, my little baby girl just thought, I'm out of here.
I don't want to be here, I want to go. This thing is not opening. I can't get it to open. Well, I'll, what's this? Um, I'll just post that. <coughs> right, where's this? Oh, here. Oh, I just want a phone number. Where's it? No, that's not it. No. Oh, man. I just looking for his phone number quickly. Hurry up. I just want his phone number. I wrote it down somewhere, but I write things everywhere. I never put it anywhere where I can find it. Why is my computer so slowed up? This is terrible. Timed out. Oh, gosh. The, the connections here are so terrible. The, the internet connection is so terrible. <coughs> it always does this, and I'm not happy with it. I'm not really happy with it. Where's Google? Oh, gosh. All right, I'll try again. Error. Your connection is not private. Back to safety. Gosh, what's going on here? I can't get through to him, yet I can get through to everybody else. Well, I might have to just use that, leave that for now, because I haven't got a f Oh, it's in here. I'm not having my phone. This is a useless phone because it never keeps the track of the people who ring. Can't even get the numbers. It's just terrible. I was trying to find it. It's just wasting my time looking for his number. <coughs> <coughs> looking for the lawyer's number. Because I didn't write it down. Terrible, man. I'm just looking for a number. I can't get it on YouTube. I mean, on online. I can't. I can't get into his phone number. Something has gone wrong with the connection. Yet I can get YouTube. It's all working. Everything else is working except his number. That's strange. See, I'm on Facebook. And. It's working perfect. It's just working perfect. And my email is working perfect. Just open up my email. Yep, there it is. And now I'm going to Utah Troy, lawyer, to get his phone number. And your connection is not secure. It has dropped his connection right out. Well, I'll be blown. Somebody has blocked him off. I'm trying another site to him. This is just making it real super suspicious because I'm recording everything and sticking straight on Facebook so you can see what what I'm going through trying to get on to my lawyer the connection has timed out and yet right next door the Facebook is working I'm just flicking around my Facebook but the Google is not working to get his phone number how strange is that why are somebody blocking me from getting to you type Troy on Google. Okay, I'll try something else on Google. I'll put John Wanoa Wanoa in Google and see what happens. There, all my stuff on Google has come out. I'll put you type Troy here. I'm telling you on this video. I'm just telling you. You are it Troy. 
I'm going to tell you what. I'll put the camera on it. See, I've just typed. Hang on, I'll just show you. This is strange. Look, I've just typed you type choice lawyers here. There, right? Type, type, type. Get that right. You type choice lawyers. And there's his site there. Lawyer, principal, right. Now, yesterday I, I, I managed to get his phone number off here. I'll see if his phone number is here, on here. We, I saw it here somewhere, hang on. Somebody's playing around with me trying to get through to him. There's his address, 17 Albert Street. And where's the phone number gone? You see, that's why I bowled into his office without an appointment, because there's something suspicious going on in there. This is not behaviour. This is not usual behaviour. I'm, I'm just showing you that I saw the phone number in here and now it's not there. Push that and see what happens. There, look. Your connection is not secure. Go back. Why is it not secure? And here we are. I should show you. John, one hour. One hour. Yeah, I'll just put John one off and open the same thing and there it goes straight to my site. Look, why is Utai Choi all of a sudden become a risky place to go to? Yet I was on it yesterday. Okay, I was I was on Utai Choi yesterday. And why has Utai Choi Utai Choi Choi Utai Choi disappeared? I'll try one of his other sites, this one, here, Hickson's, right, Hickson's, because <coughs> that's who he works for, Hickson's, Hickson's, and see if that works, see it's taking a long time to kick in, <coughs> I thought it was Higgins, but it's Hickson's lawyers, Australia, that's who he contracts to, so there's something not quite right going on here, why is it taking so long there, look, see what happened, I'm just showing you, this guy has been blocked off from getting to me or being online. Now, this is serious. This is serious. That a lawyer, you can't get to a lawyer. My lawyer. There he is there. Now, I've got his phone number. Okay, I can stick it back on me. I've got managed to get one out of them. Not that dumb. I'm not that dumb. But there's something suspicious going on. Now I managed to get through to one of his sites. Okay, here goes. That's why I open everything up. I never hide nothing. So I can't see why they can't hide anything from me. I'm straight up honest. That was funny. Try again. I'm recording this. Hello, Lady Choi. Yes, could I speak to Mr. Choi, please? Of, um, would he be there today? No, he went to overseas. Oh, when is he going to come back? I don't know. Can another lawyer carry on with my case there in, in his absence? No, I don't think so. Oh, that's um, not very really good. So can the company uh, work for me still? No. <laughs> Why not? Yes, I have. I sent you a letter to him just now. No, I've sent a, I've, we haven't got anything. It's in the email. I, I'll bring it in person because I already the chiefs have given you a, no, a, a book and it's it's there because we, we filmed... Yeah, any time so you can pick up the, your book. So that means you don't want to, to act for us? No, I'm so sorry because it's our principal is not available. 
Or why is he not want to carry on with he, us? He's overseas. He can't carry on. He's okay, so I will pick up the book. That's all we can do at this stage. Yes. Okay? Okay. I'll come in and pick it up. Oh, no problem. Thank you. Bye. There you go. Now, that is strange. He's avoiding me. The other day he was there. All of a sudden he's gone overseas. I'm going to cite him for obstruction of justice in New Zealand. And he has signed himself as liable on this video for signing John Key as criminal. Gone into the High Court of Admiralty in London. It's all on film. The same as this. I'm citing her, that woman, in that company, Yu Tai Choi Lawyers, YT Lawyers, as being covering up the fraud of John Key because he's acting for John Key, the criminal, fraudster, defrauded the public of New Zealand and the Paramount Chiefs. He's in real trouble now because <coughs> he failed to accept his bill for all the work he's done for me and rather than pay the bill, which was I going to do with the Paramount Chiefs, I see now that she has just confirmed that she didn't have the book yesterday and now she's saying she's come and pick it up. And she never received the email. I just sent it to her. I'm going to read it out to you straight from the email so you can see the thuggery and fraud going on in that company. <coughs> I'm showing you on this video today on Tuesday, the 3rd of October 2017, for the record, in this country, the courts are, and the lawyers and judges, are corrupted to hell. That's why we're taking this country back, because of this. This lawyer committed John Key on documents into the High Court of Admiralty in London, and he's walking away from it as if nothing happened. No, it's all on record. Just as well, I filmed it. I filmed it all in their office with him there. So he can't get away with it. Mr. Yu Tai Choi, I'm holding you as liable for all that you have done for John Key to cover up the fraud of the Panama Papers and the money, the $13 million that he sent to Hillary Clinton and her terrorist organization. It's all on film. It's all on social media, and you're stuck right in the middle. Your company is now liable for a trillion pound on your head for starters. On this video, cite it. Just for that. A trillion pounds plus for everything you're denying or walking away from because you don't want to get your hands dirty. Your hands are dirty. You're handling dirty titles. So I have to get another lawyer to take you out and all of the lawyers out. I'll get a British lawyer to come and clean your lot out because this is not good, especially when I'm trying to get onto your sites and they're blocked off. Who's blocking it off, Mr. Choi? Who is blocking your sites off against this authority that John Key came and got this put on him? as if he owns our authority. Now, this is serious. This is for the British Navy, First Lord of the Sea, Sir Philip Jones, our partner, our legal partner, Flag, Paramount Chiefs, that this is going on right in front of you on this video. I'm citing this video straight to Sir Philip Jones, First Lord of the Sea. That's our legal partner, and the British Westminster government. <coughs> that today, I have been disturbed by what this office lady of Utah Troy has just told me, that the British will find out where he is to see if he is overseas or he's just avoiding me. 
He knew we were going to go down to his office, the Paramount Chiefs. It's on video, it's on YouTube, us going there. We've got a video of them in the office taking this book. We're coming to get it. Now she's admitted, come and get, pick your book up. I'll go and pick the book up, all right? But I'll also film me getting the book because I'm coming in to get it <coughs> with my, my friend. Dion Hart and pick it up or I'll come by myself but I'm coming in I can get the Paramount Chiefs to come and get it so that I think that's the best the Paramount Chiefs will come and walk in the office and get it get that book see just to show what you're up to you're gonna get found out because the British are watching me watching you and the Freemasons the Freemasons that's who I am with them, with Moi Temati Marako. <coughs> so I'm going to read you this before the film runs out. Um, I'm going to just find the letter, the email. I'm going to read it out to you so that it's gone in the email because it's received. I can see. Right, I'm going to turn it on. There it is there. Look, here is the email, the proposal. To you Thai Choi lawyers, I've sent at 11.38 a.m. today, 58 minutes ago, to you Thai Choi, Nahatu Ewa Aote Limited, OSMB 16, Park Avenue, Oduhu 1062, supposed to be South Auckland, YT Choi lawyers, 17 Albert Street, Central City, Auckland, Tuesday 3rd of October 2017. Dear Choi, Mr. Choi. I came in to introduce the Paramount Chiefs of Waitangi and Titi Marae to you and this day we held a native magistrate court hearing in Te Unga Waka Marae in Epsom below One Tree Hill, a central point of the Moriori Manukau historic point where all the chiefs met <coughs> in the early days. <coughs> in the early days we now at this point bringing the original true native commercial landers to meet you. In our discussions, the Chiefs have decided that you will represent them in all commercial land ownership legal matters directly to Westminster Magistrate Court and High Court in London that I had previously set up with you and now has become a reality with the Titi Marae Chiefs covering this whole country in one place, Titi Marae and Waitangi Marae, where our British UK Ship of Admiralty holds our King William IV 1834 Declaration of War State of Emergency flag of the Magistrate Court Bank jurisdictions together under the Native King's Bench Court. There are four live Paramount Chiefs carrying the surnames titles came to see you. These surnames, their surnames stretch back to 1820, Paramount Chief Terawakato Whare Herehere Manukau Moriori, Ma Paramount Chief from Cambridge, Waikato region, represented by J.P. Justice of the Peace Manahi Parapara Mohini. Crown Court's Justice of the Peace Kaitaia Northland Courts Representative, Notary Public. Bundy Waitai, Prison, Komatua in Kaitaia, Crown, <coughs> Employees, Supervisor, Cook Island, Taishan, Paramount Chief, <coughs> representing Paramount Chief Hongi Hika, who went to Cambridge University with Chief Waikato Manukau in 1820 with Bishop Thomas Kendall from Hokianga. Hiruini Karaka, 90 year war veteran, Selwyn Clark, British settler. Immigrant legal partner to these native Paramount Chiefs, Paramount Chief Justice in the New Zealand Native Magistrate Court, Epsom, to Titi Marae Native Magistrate Court, to Waitangi Native Magistrate Court, with Selwyn Clark and his British Ship of Admiralty and our flag flying on that ship direct to Westminster Magistrate Court and direct to Edinburgh Magistrate Court, where Paramount Chief Tera Waikato Wharehirehire Manukau transferred New Zealand and Pacific Islands countries to King George IV, Westminster government in 1820 to 1830 period, transferred to his brother, King William IV, reigning monarch, 1830 to 1837 period of our 1834 flag sovereign authority two-party commercial trading bank partnership, still intact, unbroken. <coughs> 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 The Queen Victoria and Queen Elizabeth II Crown Corporation is a third party to the Paramount Chiefs Admiralty Court Martial Law Jurisdiction, two-party private contract. I wish you to represent with J.P. Manahi Parapara Mohini, 
at that level of authority and jurisdiction, and myself as the Sheriff Native Court Registrar in our court hearings on YouTube, Friday the 29th of September 2017, I organised the whole event on record to Britain. I want you to administer the legal side of the New Zealand chiefs that supersedes the Maori Iwi Authority who have no legal titles. I am the Paramount Chief Executor of the Paramount Chiefs Te Rawaikato Whare Herehere Manukau, commercial landowner of New Zealand and at that time of 1820 that is private and not in the New Zealand Crown history. They failed to challenge these Paramount Chiefs with their native land patent titles <coughs> which I hold as Freemasons Manukau title to New Zealand country. My Paramount Chief name is Hawani Kahaki Wano on my birth certificate and New Zealand passport. We need you to come with us to Westminster Magistrate Court and the High Court in London and Westminster Parliament as the New Zealand legal representative with JP Manahi Parapara Mohini and the direct bloodline descendant to Paramount Chief Tera Waikato Whare Here Here Manukau of Maungatautili Parsite in Cambridge, New Zealand to Cambridge University, England, UK private contract signing agreements. Paramount Chief Hongi Hika was responsible for the British Royal Navy Military Protectorate. With the Paramount Chief's support in the courts, I am more confident with our business relationship to trade internationally through the world under our one and only King's Admiralty shipping flag of free passage through the entire world unheeded. I make a proposal to you to take on the Moai Tidal Turbine Project I set up in South Korea with Kaui, Kui, design engineers in Suban with Hyundai and Daewoo engineering companies. I told you before that I will do it myself on second thought. I will now make a contract deal with you on the basis of New Zealand license to be the legal representative for Moai Tidal Energy and Paramount Chiefs commercial land titles under our 1834 Declaration of War Flag Jurisdiction Partnership with the British Royal Navy, First Lord of the Sea Sir Philip Jones, and Prime Minister Theresa May. By the way, my Wano family carries the Northern Ireland Rogan Cosgrove coat of arms royalty in Belfast where St. Patrick is buried is my title there with my statue on East Isle, East Isle as my other Wano Royal Tyson Memorial standing in Queen Elizabeth Great II Great Court in London of my Royal Tyson family inheritance linked to the Northern Ireland DUP Party coalition with Theresa May Tory Party in Westminster Parliament, making a straight path into Parliament for me. I am going to live in Paddington, where the Westminster Magistrate Court is, in Westminster City, my new hometown, as ambassador for 250 countries. Our King William IV flag is going into from Auckland, New Zealand. Please make my invoice bill up for the work you have done since I first met you and the time I have spent with you with the documents I went over with you now stamped by these three Paramount Chiefs and myself. And please be so generous as to change the reasonable amount for ongoing complaints. <coughs> Camera's still going. Complaints, claims that we put through the Native Magistrate Court in Epsom, Auckland is a fixed venue, Authority Marae closest to One Tree Hill and the Moriori Paramount Chiefs Memorial dead buried there, up there. And I would like to you to complete the Cook Street case and I shall alert the ANZ Bank of the progress to remove the two director landowners and transfer the title back to our four Paramount Chiefs and Moai Crown King William IV Trust. Please let me come to see you to make a deal on all issues including the commercial projects and draw up the contract, I would like an appointment to see you to discuss matters with your team. I have my team in Britain waiting and now the Paramount Chiefs waiting for your agreement. I will call you now. Sincerely, John Wanor, Director, Customary Legal Advocate, Surrogate King William IV. Here is the New Zealand Native Magistrate Court on Friday, 29th September 2017, before we came to your office to bring a fresh sign mandate and court hearing legal authority flag and crown land patent memorials in this bound up book manual case citations and acts of King William IV Westminster Parliament we so choose to enforce on criminals operating on these native lands. The New Zealand Crown is setting, settling treaty claims with the inferior iwi Maori chiefs of no Whakapapa original native titles. I am holding as executor 
of the Moriori Manukau Crown Land Patent Memorials over New Zealand country no man, woman, child can possibly refute outright. I was never charged for the Cook Street case where I was unlawfully arrested and imprisoned. The Auckland District Court Judge Grant found me innocent and the CIB News and Police had insufficient evidence to convict me and strip me of my King William IV surrogate shirt and used as exhibit to convict me. I left it in the police custody as exhibit A to convict the police and I never got my say in court. They put me my date to a week later and then put the U UN Ma Maori marshals on the stand, then dismissed them all and me. My barrister represented those prisoners as a conflict of interest because I hired them and those Maori marshals didn't want lawyers, rather they wanted to speak for themselves. That day the justice failed to represent me because of what I said to the judge representing myself direct from prison and into the dock live. I made a sworn statement that Judge, your court has no Queen above your head, no seal of Westminster, and no seal of Queen Elizabeth II, and no legal authority to try me in this court over my legal authority as a surrogate King William IV jurisdiction of Admiralty Court Martial Law. So here is the court hearing. YouTube cited fact evidence. Historic milestone event at 12 noon, Friday, 29th September 2017, case against ex PM, Prime Minister John Key, and the landowners of 77 Cook Street, originally 161 bar, bar 61 Cook Street, Auckland, and including others to charge against me, the injured party is very serious. If they don't challenge me, it's now a double defaulted contract case. John Key sold his house and moved off to Australia, away from here as a threat against our New Zealand national interests for his own financial investment interests, defrauded the public of New Zealand and First of all, the Paramount Chiefs of New Zealand country. The Crown New Zealand is still trying to buy Na Napui. Hapu Chiefs have now no show of doing that. Now that John Key has caused the damage and that is why we complain to the British government that the justice system here is corrupted and doesn't work for us New Zealanders. The Paramount Chiefs have distanced themselves from Maori as an invention of the New South Wales New Zealand Crown Private Corporations Trust. Chief Kingi Taurua Ariki with Willy Peter Ariki Le Elder and Hoepa Epiha Ariki Elder opened the Waitangi Marae King's Bench Native Magistrate Court on 15th, Friday 15th of April 2016 with Murray Rapana, Cultural Manager of Waitangi Trust Committee and Waitangi National Trust and Police Constable Paul Tipene of the Kerikeri Police Station attending and witnessing this historic event for the birth of the New Zealand UK Crown Land Records appeared applied to this Te Unga Waka Marae Court as of 29th September 2017 from 6th of February 2017 at Titi Marae and Waitangi Marae Native Court on 15 March 2016 for New Zealand Crown Land Court Records performed in this Te Unga Waka Marae original 1820-1834 traditional cultural heritage of Tikanga Moai law law practice, L-O-R-E, L-A-W, practice, legal status, jurisdiction of sovereign authority of King William the Fourth Ship of Admiralty 1834 founding New Zealand flag by the British resident James Reedy Clendon at Okiato Native Magistrate Court on the 20th of March 1834, this founding flag of New Zealand legally binding on both New Zealand and UK crowns by these Moai Crown Paramount Chiefs correct surname witness on the Waitangi Treaty grounds at 5am transferred to the Titi Marae Native Magistrate Court on 6th of February 2017, transferred to Te Ngoaka Marae Native King's Bench Magistrate Court on Friday 29th of September 2017, enforced King William IV Acts of Westminster Parliament 1830-1837 by the four Paramount Chiefs as undisputed, legitimate and legal flag Sovereign Authority Trading Bank flag commercial landowners of New Zealand country and their memorials intact. The video says that at Te Waka Marae, the four Paramount Chiefs opened the Titi Marae Grand, uh, Native Grand Jury King's Bench Mag Magistrate Court with a 21 gun salute of the New Zealand Re Royal Navy at 12 noon on 6th of February 2017. That's that video there to prove, uh, cited. Uh, video uh, evidence um, um, fact 
the Yunga, Te Yunga Waka Marae, Marae uh, in Ipsum below, One Tree Hill, four Paramount Chiefs opened up Te Yunga Waka Marae near to Magistrate Court on Friday, 29th September 2017, and there's a the video there, one, two, three, four, five videos. Please make up my bill, the Chiefs will take care of and settle to your bank account in a pro rata deal partnership of future business through Moai Crown, UK New Zealand World Trading Bank and Trading Business Accord. You will have the Paramount Chief's blessing to have continued business while you and I make contract deals worldwide and direct to Westminster Government under the, this 1834 Declaration of War, DOW. King's flag we made legal on Friday 29th of September 2017 in Te, Ungawaka, Te Ungawaka, Marae, Ipsum under the Manukau Moriori title origins to Edinburgh Magistrate Court Lieutenant William Simons, 23rd Regiment of the British Royal Navy in 1820-1830, period of King George IV Crown land patent, native Moriori Paramount Chief Tira Waikato Whare Herehere Manukau title transfer to New Zealand and Pacific Islands countries into the British Crown Corporation's Commercial Trading Bank title lease lands instruments with the flag as a British Navy military private contract for legal and military protection of our two-party partnership of Admiralty corporate business. This title transfer from New Zealand country Dutch Zealand Security of Investment Bank Interest document instrument made the Paramount Chiefs Tira Waikato Whare Herehere Herehere Manukau a shareholder and commercial landowner from 1820 to the present date in Auckland on the 29th September 2017 as a milestone under the British UK land patent transfer system from 1820 thereon. King George IV, brother of King William IV, transferred the new King George IV title to King William IV in 1830. He transferred to Paramount Chief Rewhere from Manukau on his Manukau Pass site at Pupunga Settlement Village at the Manukau Heads entrance to the harbour in Auckland. <coughs> the land transferred to Paramount Chief Temati Manukau, 4th Freemason, Edinburgh Magistrate Court Freemason to Awaroa Magistrate Court in Helensville, Kaipara, and then he transferred his Freemason title interest and British Crown laden patent interest to me, Hoani Kahaki Wanoa his Paramount Chief Executor, successor of his 50-year service to the Freemasons in Helenville, documents are held in a private contract of Admiralty Court Martial Law jurisdiction under this 1834 Declaration of War Flag, Sovereign Authority over New Zealand Pacific Islands Doctrines of Discovery Title, added to the Moai Crown Doctrines of Discovery Title. The King William IV British Crown Title is transferred to the new British Empire State Building proposed for Cornwall Park beside One Tree Hill and the Manukau Memorial Burial Ground Park site at the top of One Tree Hill Lookout, Whakapapa to the Moriori Manukau Paramount Chiefs and Waikato Giant Paramount Chief Kafaru the Giant. I have his plaque title here with me while we seize the original back from Ngāti Whātua Iwi Māori leaders and their New Zealand Crown Corporations hiding the original Kafaru Memorial plaque away. I want back for the Paramount Chief's stolen property recovery salvage. I am the Paramount Chief Historian and Moriori Manukau Maui Crown Land Patent Title Holder, John Wanoa. So there's the videos there of the opening of the Magistrate Court in Te Unga Wakaro Marae in um, Epsom and here in Titi Marae, 21 Gun Salute, on the 6th of February 2017, here in Ipsum on the 29th, Friday the 29th of uh, September 2017, and here in um, Titi Marae, uh, opening and signing the documents of the new Magistrate Court, uh, Native Magistrate Court. And here in Waitangi, we opened it up in Waitangi with Kingi Taurua, the Waitangi Marae King's Bench Native Magistrate Court. And here, uh, here we opened it up in Tuungawaka Marae, Native Magistrate Court, and here and it's um, the same as well. And here I'm just making the statements today and this video here to solidify our contract with the British, two-party contract with the British Navy, um, First Lord of the Sea, Sir Philip Jones, and um, um, the British Government, Westminster Parliament, uh, Theresa May. And the DUP party, I'm joining with the Moai King William party, and Matt Taylor, um, um, their our manager in Brighton, 
England <coughs> shift to Paddington to take up that role. So there is the letter in its entirety that this Secretary of Yu Tai Choi says she never got it. And here I'm just showing you. There's his address it went to. John Monar, my ng at gmail.com, you tai choi, you tai choi at ytchoylawyers.com. Tuesday, 3rd of October 2017 at 11.38 a.m. Propose Zol and invoice update bill to me to to me from you tai choi lawyers. I'm, I'm telling them we'll pay his bill and he's re refusing it. They're just walking away the other way as if nothing happened. So there you are, people. I just want to show you the evidence of what a lawyer has got into serious trouble. And a QC lawyer at that is now cited. He is cited as fraudulent and corrupted the justice system in this country, New Zealand. So for the record, for the British record, for the New Zealand record today, I, Kwani Kahaki Wano, swear to God, to tell the truth and nothing about the truth, so help me God, I have just cited Yu Tai Choi, South Korean lawyer, <coughs> for me, <coughs> from 2012, 2014, 2017, lawyer for John Key as well, has now been cited, fact evidence to step before the native grand jury trial magistrate court in Epsom. The trial for you, you and all the other police are coming next. Everyone, 43 of you that stopped me on Cook Street uh, from seizing it back into these paramount chiefs ownership and myself being the fourth paramount chief ownership. We are the ones that hold the Te Rawakato Whare Here Here Manukau paramount chief title in Edinburgh Magistrate Court Bank that no one can inquire into. That's our business. So with that, because a lawyer can't represent me and the chiefs, I've just showed you a proposal because he wanted the contract for the South Korean companies, Hyundai and Daewoo, I had set up for the tidal turbine power generators in the sea, he's just walked away from and doesn't want to be paid for anything. What does that tell you? A prime suspect in a case that's prevalent right through this government in New Zealand. Why all our forms of justice for our claims are exhausted. That means the British we call on the British to come straight in here and take them out. But the bill remains. You, Tai Choi, you've got a trillion pounds on your head and your business is up in front of the court for fraud and corruption of the legal system, the justice system in New Zealand. I'm just accusing you right on this YouTube video, right in front of the world, with my own authority with this flag as a court martial contract on your head from our partners in Britain, UK. Westminster Magistrate Court. A trillion pounds is on your head for tempering with the evidence that we have before us that you won't represent with your name scribbled all over it and signed and stamped, gone into the High Court of Admiralty in London. That's our proof. And the video on the other end to say, Kirsty Irving got it for judge.